Um, with most classes um, at our school now having an iPad, um, I thought I'd go through and just do a quick tutorial on how I've been using an app called Show Me um, to share what the students have been doing um, using the iPad. So they've used Show Me to go ahead and create a little tutorial um, which records their thinking as they go through and solve a particular problem. So in this instance, um, a student's gone through and shown me how they can use uh, the equal addition strategy. So from here, what I want to be able to do is share this um, in a way that um, they can comment, I can comment, we can give each other feedback, we can discuss this with other students. So um, the way that I'm going to do that is um, by sharing it to Edmodo. Um, the first thing I've done is I've clicked the manage tab over here and I've made sure that with each of these I've changed the to private. Um, within Edmodo it's a private group um, only the students have been added in there so it is still being shared but in this instance not really appropriate to share with the wider community. So I've changed the settings I'm going to click done here. Now what I'm going to do is um, find a usable link that we can then share it with um, so, coming back to Chad here, what I'm going to do is click on the arrow here and choose the option Open in Safari. When you create a Show Me, it automatically um, adds it to the internet, it uploads it, and it adds it to their site. So, by opening it in Safari, what I can do is click on the address bar, click once more, and choose the option Select All and it will pop up with cut, copy paste so I'm going to copy that now I'm double clicking on my home button here to get the background apps and I'm going to choose Edmodo which I've already got open um, when I make a new post what I'm going to do is click on link tap in the link um, bar tap once more to bring up the paste menu paste in that link and then attach it and then you'll notice that it's come up it's picked up Chad's name the way that he's um, named his file and then it's ready for me to write my comment here and choose who I'm sending that to so if we look at a couple of examples um, I've given Brandon a bit of feedback here or Josh um, whether they've worked it out correctly but maybe haven't rounded the subject in so specific feedback great using Show Me because I can hear the students thinking as well as seeing their um, recording so excellent feedback for them and then they can come back and they can read my feedback they can reply um, and it gives you a great way to have that discussion um, even though you, you're not necessarily face to face with the student so students can then come through after reading my feedback and click on their link go ahead and play it um, and then they can, I guess, reflect on their own thinking um, as well as other students having the opportunity to go through and give them feedback and comment as well. So Show Me, uh, I think it's a free app, um, but paired with Edmodo is a great way to be able to share those um, videos with other students. Underneath folders here, what I've done is I've started adding the post to the library um, so if students come in to have a look at the equal edition folder now for each strategy or show me topic that we're recording for I would have come through and see example videos so hopefully later on in the year um, even when we're working on other strategies or other areas they'll be able to come back underneath folders um, have a look at a particular learning area or strategy, click on it and then they'll be able to have access to that information. Um, posts as you know as new information gets added things drop down the page and eventually disappear and drop off the end so um, saving posts, adding them to your library can be quite a good way to be able to refer back to them later. So I choose this little drop arrow, um, add that post to the library um, from <coughs> excuse me clicking on my library up here I can then 
select the post um, I can then over here choose which folder that's going to be going into so over here it's going into my um, equal edition folder and I'm going to apply that and if I come to my equal edition folder over here I can see that that has been shared with um, one group and that has been shared with the Room 17 Math students. So that's just very quickly um, how I'm using ShowMe and Edmodo um, with my students.